Hi there and welcome back to Kitten School. A viewer recently asked how I control cat hair in my house. And this is a great question because with our own eight cats and anywhere from three to ten foster kitties at any given time, there's a lot of cats under one roof. Keeping the fur from taking over the house requires a little work every day, but there are some simple things that I do to help keep it under control. First and most important, I brush my cats. Fortunately, they love this, so when I bring out the brush, they all come running. I try to give each cat a good brushing once a week. Doing this regularly really helps to cut down on shedding, and it's also healthy for your cat. Brushing stimulates the circulation, it sloughs away dead skin cells, and helps to prevent hairballs. All my cats benefit from brushing, from long-haired Malu here, to my very short-haired creature. And if you think short hair cats don't shed a lot, guess again. My Siamese cat Sing Sing sheds the most out of all my cats, even though he has short fur. And the more loose fur you get off with the brush, the less fur is gonna be on your furniture, on your clothes, and also won't be ingested by your kitty. Start brushing your cat when it's a kitten and they will begin to think of it as a very special treat. A regular brushing routine can go a long way to cutting down on the fur, but a lot of it still gets on the floor, so we sweep. I use a swiveling, nubby microfiber broom to pick up loose fur from our terrazzo tile floors. It easily picks up every single hair, and then you just take the broom outside and shake it all out. The microfiber cloth comes off so you can throw it in the washer when it gets dirty. And last, I love using washable throws to cover places that the cats love to lounge, like our couch and our bed. I buy inexpensive throws only in white, cream, and taupe colors so that they look good just layered on top of each other all throughout the house. When one starts looking a little dirty, you can just throw it in the washing machine. The cats can really beat them up and it's no big deal because they're pretty inexpensive. I can just replace them if they get worn out. Another place that our cats love to sleep is on our bed pillows. So I have one large pillow just for them. That way when we go to sleep, we don't wake up with a face full of cat fur. Do you have any tips for keeping your home fur free? Let us know in the comments section. I always love to hear from you. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe and join the Kitten School family. We'll see you next time.